Hey friends, welcome to Essentially Jesse. Today I wanted to battle it out between two Tom Ford fragrances, Eau de Soleil Blanc and Soleil Blanc. So let's get to it. I have other Tom Ford battles, so if you want to check those out, you can check them out in the description box below. Before we get started with this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also give me a like if you love Tom Ford. So we're starting off with Soleil Blanc. This is newer to my collection. I picked this up in Miami on vacation and I thought I wanted this. I'd read the notes, but I never actually smelled it. And I bought Eau de Soleil Blanc. I blind bought it over the summer last year. And I thought that I was purchasing this one, but I was buying the Eau de Soleil Blanc anyway. I got a little confused so I kept it but then I really wanted this one but I wanted to smell it before I dropped the money on it so this is part of the private blend collection it is in the white bottle with the gold Soleil Blanc is part of Tom Ford's private blend collection I picked up the 50 ml because this is pricey this comes in at 250 for this 50 ml and it goes up from there um, uh, okay, so you know I love coconuts, and this has coconut. It is a, I mean, I would wear this wedding day fragrance. I would, I have a full review on this. Anyway, it's beautiful. It's got ylang in it. It's got, let me look. Okay. It has Coco de Mer, ylang, and cardamom are the main notes. The cardamom really warms it up. It makes it interesting, and it's nice. Anyway, I have a full review on that. I will link it in the comments below, but this is good. Long lasting, great fragrance for summer. I mean, I think it's warm enough that you can wear it year round. This is signature scent worthy. This is a fantastic, fantastic fragrance. And I just love the Coco de Mariner and everything about it, everything about it, okay? Uh, Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc. Next up, we have Eau de Soleil Blanc. This is a 2018 release from Tom Ford. In the big bottle, it comes in the frosted glass, which is why the travel atomizer looks like that. Eau de Soleil Blanc is a fresh floral fragrance. The notes are citrus, pistachio, jasmine, tuberose, ylang, orange flower, and amber. This is part of the Tom Ford Private Blend Collection. It is a citrusy white floral. It is a beautiful fragrance. If you love citrus fragrances, I have a friend who is a diehard citrus lover. If that is you, you need to smell this fragrance. It's light, it's fresh, it's clean. It's citrusy, but still has some florals to kind of warm it up where it's not just super bright all the time. It is has more of a tropical feel because of the ylang in it. It is a beautiful fragrance. Some YouTubers have said that it might have like a slight pickle fragrance. I don't really pick that up in the notes, but sometimes I do. Like sometimes I'll get a little whiff of it and I think mm, there's that pickle something. I don't know, but it is a beautiful fragrance. It is a great fragrance for spring and summer. Probably wouldn't wear this. You could wear it daytime, fall and winter, but I, it's not a, um, heavy hitter enough for me for fall and winter, but that's just me. This is signature scent worthy. You can wear this every day. This would be a great fragrance for the office, for vacation. When it is warmer outside in summer and the high heat and you wanna just put something on very refreshing, this is a great choice for that type of situation or maybe an outdoor wedding. There'll probably be quite a few of those this year. This is a really nice fragrance. I'm glad that I picked up the travel size. This does not last as long on my skin, which is fairly typical for citrus heavy fragrances. The dry down on this is really pretty, but it isn't gonna be citrusy in the dry down. Citruses typically are there and then they go away rather quickly. They're usually in the top notes and so you, if you do like citruses, you definitely want to smell this and wear it before you buy it because you want to make sure that you like the way it smells once the citrus kind of evaporates and it turns into more of the mid and the base notes. Eau de Soleil Blanc by Tom Ford is a really nice, clean, fresh, citrusy fragrance. It's good. 
So in this battle between Tom Ford Soleil Blanc and Tom Ford Eau de Soleil Blanc, the clear winner for me is Soleil Blanc. I really love this fragrance. It's warmer, it's spicier, but it's still got that I don't know, tropical vibe. I will be wearing this a lot in spring and summer this year. I think that it is a beautiful fragrance. I still love Eau de Soleil Blanc, but it's just not, I'm just not as into citruses. So this one is a little bit warmer, it's spicier, it's beautiful. I feel like it's more interesting too. I kind of wish I'd bought the bigger bottle, but anyway. We'll go through this rather quickly and get another one. I don't know. Which fragrances in your collection are like backup bottle worthy? Drop that in the comments below because this may be one. I don't know. I need to wear it more. It is a newer purchase for me. I picked this up, oh, maybe a month or so ago and I am loving it. This is Soleil Blanc by Tom Ford. Thank you guys so much for watching. Do you guys have Tom Ford Soleil Blanc or Eau de Soleil Blanc? If you do, let me know which one you prefer in the comments below. I love getting to interact with you guys, learn about your fragrance preferences, learn about new fragrances that you guys love. Are there any other Tom Fords that I need to pick up? I wanna know. Drop me a comment below. Don't forget to hit subscribe and also click that little notification bell to be notified of all future videos, reviews, top tens, battles. We do it all. Smell you later.